Good morning. I am Dr. Satish Kari, head of the chemistry department. On the behalf of the chemistry department, I welcome all of you to the SYBSC class. After a long duration, after this pandemic situation, you are back to the your studies. So, in this year, that is 2020-21, in this academic year, you are from last year you are facing the choice-based study system, and this year this is your third and fourth semester that you are going to face. And so, in the third semester, in the third semester. In chemistry, we are going to have three subjects. First is your physical and analytical chemistry. The second one is your 302, that is inorganic and organic chemistry. So, as in the choice of the study system, the total marking system, the pattern of these studies has been discussed with you by my colleague Dr. So here we are going to deal with this second subject that is inorganic and organic chemistry where the section, this will be divided into two sections, the first section is your inorganic chemistry, the second section will be your organic chemistry. Inorganic chemistry will be taught to you by Dr. Yanandalvi where I will teach you organic chemistry. So while studying organic chemistry. You studied organic chemistry since 11th standard as a separate subject in which we are studying the different carbon compounds due to the catenation property of the carbon it's having a tendency to form a large number of compounds and these compounds are classified on the basis of their different functional groups so in 11th and 12th, you said all the different types of functional groups that are in the organic chemistry. In first year, you studied the chemical bondings, then the stereochemistry, then you studied the chemistry of hydrocarbons, and in that, you studied alkanes, alkenes, and alkynes. So now, in this third semester, that is the second year of your degree. We are going to deal in this first semester, third semester, we are going to deal with the three different topics. The first topic that is aromatic hydrocarbons. In aromatic hydrocarbons, we have studied benzene in 12th standard, we have studied the different reactions of benzene. But here again, when we are going to study aromatic hydrocarbons, it's necessary because you must know because you have studied the superficial properties and now here we are going to increase the depth of your studies. So in this topic we are going to deal with the introduction of this topic that is what are aromatic compounds, how they are classified, what is the difference between the aromatic and non-aromatic compounds and the different types of aromatic compounds. What is the difference in this? <coughs> so, after introduction, we are going to deal with the nomenclature, and this nomenclature will be studied according to the International Union of Pure and Applied Chemistry. So, the difference is that the plain aromatic compounds or the substituted aromatic compounds that will be your mono substituted, di substituted, or tri substituted. How you are going to name the compounds and what is the standard method that we are going to learn. Then we will learn the preparations. Preparations of the. And in this topic, we are going to study the case that is benzene. Means we are not going to study all organic compounds, uh, aromatic compounds, only benzene is to be studied. And in benzene, what are the different preparation methods of benzene? And so, preparation of benzene from phenol from carboxylic acids, from acetylene.